The city of Kelowna says it's ready to activate its warming buses for those living on the streets if the temperature continues to drop. Bylaw Services Manager Kevin Mead says the city has a graduated response to extreme weather. When the temperature dips below uh, minus 10, um, that's when the city will activate its protocol and uh, bring on board some of the warming buses that we've coordinated with some local agencies um, to help provide some reprieve, particularly overnight for the community sheltering outdoors. Mead says this year the city has received buses from multiple community partners. Every year, those living out on the streets do what they can to keep warm. Some start fires in tents. The Kelowna Fire Department has already been called to multiple fires along the rail trail and in homeless encampments. So when it comes to warming fires and the like, we work with uh, not only the fire department, but the RCMP, uh, Downtown Kelowna Association and the like, to ensure that there's a common understanding about what is acceptable when. And we really try to take a humanitarian and a graduated response to that as well. The City of Kelowna expects the completion of 120 supportive housing units by January. I think at any time uh, or any point in time when we can partner with uh, whether it's BC Housing, whether it's our not-for-profit partners or whether it's private interest groups to provide some reprieve for the community, uh, we, we ought to do so and from a city perspective we are making every effort to do that uh, at, at every juncture. For Castanet News, I'm Madison Reeve in Kelowna. Thank you.